It's night one in Northampton. Cheers. And Cockneys, Scott and Shelley are hoping to win a thousand pounds with dishes no one has ever heard of. <laughs> Absolutely amazing. They're the kind of people, aren't they, Shell? Yeah, they are. Yeah. I've separated two already with regards to halami. You don't need to whisper. And it's good to go. Not much room for dinner. <laughs> Starter. Here you go. Here you go, John. I don't eat mushrooms. How oh, do you not? Not us? No. Oh, so I'll just sorry. eat around it. It was just like I'd eaten a sausage with cheese and peppers. <laughs> I love mushrooms, so this is really nice for me. Oh, I'm so yeah. sorry. I didn't have much like seasoning, so you could taste the sausage, the peppers and the mushroom, but really not much more than, than, than that. So we've got some accents going on around the table tonight. I was born in Bristol, but I moved when I was seven, moved to Texas. Uh, then I met this lovely lady in uh, Texas. I lost a lot of my accent, actually. Uh, we no, call no, it the no, Texas no, no. twang, because yeah, it's very so, twangy. Yeah. Let, her accent's funny. Let's just get out of the way. It makes me laugh. Say something, baby. You're putting me on the spot now. Okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> I can't do it. <laughs> you just did it. So Baby, do your Texas accent. Come on, try to sound like my brother. We go fishing for trout down there. <laughs> <laughs> we go fishing for trout down there. <laughs> That's very good, Ashley. What about Sabby? Go on, have a go. Go on, it's all right. It's fine. You've been right. If I have a go, you have a go. No. <laughs> <laughs> I wish Sabby um, would have, like, tried. Just because bit. even though I know he would have been an epic fail at the accent, I still think it would have been awesome because he's a nice fun. guy. I didn't do an accent because I didn't want to look silly. Do you think we all looked silly doing it? I think you looked silly. It's just listening to the sounds and then repeating them. No, I'm not good at that. You should practice. I'll try. Moving on. Let's get to the main way, eh? <laughs> I'm going to throw him right off here, aren't I? That'd be interesting. Absolutely. Well, that colour's enough to throw anyone off. Here it is, why I cocker lamb curry. Ooh. Hello. Here we go. Okay. Ooh. Oh, that's good. Thank you. It reminds me of like chip shop curry, that and I don't mean that in a bad no. way at all. I can safely say I don't own a chip shop. <laughs> <laughs> it's for the best. Probably shouldn't have said that at the dinner table. Yeah. I didn't take my chip shop curry as a, as a criticism. As a criticism. Yeah. It was a nice criticism because yeah, you like I... chip shop curry. I'm going to be very honest. Yeah, Sorry, please I, do. I'm Pakistani heritage, so what? we're basically like born, you know, yeah. on curry. I, I don't know what it is. I feel like there should be a bit more flavour to the curry. They're quite frank with their opinions, aren't they? Direct. Oh, yes. Yeah. They, yeah, they just said it. The, the foodie people, uh, Ilias and Amanda, I think they know their food. Why is it called Why I Cocker Lamb Curry? My granddad is a Geordie and he used to eat this. What does Why I Cocker mean? Why I in, in, is... in Newcastle means. Like a hello, hello. Isn't it's it? like yeah. a hello. Her granddad used to call everyone Cocker, so if you came so in, cocker. hi Cocker, how are you doing? Oh. Yeah. It meant something to them. It was hard to relate to a group of people, I think, at the end of the day. Yeah. You've used the word cocker on, for the main course and only you know what it means. Like, you know, <laughs> we need to be involved in the comedy um, if we're going to laugh. If you could be a famous landmark anywhere around the world, what would you be and why? I would be New York, because New York is like the apple, because it's a bit tasty and a bit crunchy and a bit sweet. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think she kind of thought that the Big Apple was an actual, an actual landmark, but it's not, <laughs> is it? <laughs> Do you remember when the O2 was built? It was the Millennium Dome, but then it got, like a purpose by becoming like a concert venue. That's like me. I had no direction when I was younger. And then when I met you, I... Oh, you're going to make it Oh, no, don't hurry. cry, don't cry. No, please don't cry. The words that Ashley said around the table was quite heartfelt and warming. Well, yeah, those yeah, words made me really cry. Nice. I get all was... emotional, I do. Yeah. I would say that I'm like the Eiffel Tower because everybody wants to come and see me. <laughs> and occasionally I sparkle and shimmer. <gasps> I loved it. <laughs> Savvy was definitely me, 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 oh, me, I thought me, it me. was so funny. <laughs> <laughs>